Six weeks later, same garage, same car. Hot damn. I don't only build cars that cut grass. Hey, what's going on everybody? You got the old Mongo man out here Wednesday evening. Spent some time in the garage last night, cleaned things up a little bit. KJ pulled Sis's car in and uh, he's got it ready to just about paint here. I got a hole in the hood I got to fix. He's getting this fire going right now, so it'll be a little bit warmer in here than it is currently. And then we're gonna, uh, we're gonna spray this car. All right, see you in a little bit. So hey, I got a theory. Um, it kind of goes like this. If you know how to do something right, it entitles you to do it wrong. I'm not one of the entitlement type, but uh, what we're doing here isn't exactly the right way, but it's getting done. We are going to paint this with uh, some Rust-Oleum 15 minute fast dry gloss black. Uh, the car is a, uh, it's a real metallic black, but uh, we just want to make it all one color, get the silver off the front of it. KJ did a really good job prepping it, getting it ready to go. We masked it off. Uh, covered up some of the areas that needed it. I fixed the hole in the hood and now we are uh, just waiting on this primer to dry Then we can get it painted So if you remember there was a big hole in that hood right there, I got that taken care of and then uh, some of the places where KJ Went through he went ahead and put some self etching primer on it just to be sure that we have good adhesion to the metal I'm Wait for that all to dry up Shouldn't take much longer. And then we're gonna squirt it black. Kind of like uh, my big brother always says, Rodney, paint it black and put it back. That's what we're gonna do. Paint it black and give it back. All right, everybody. Uh, I would say two and a half cans. Yep. Maybe two full cans. And we have the classic Buzz Bomb paint job. I'd say it doesn't look too bad. It probably looks really good on the video, I would imagine. I was telling KJ while I was spraying this thing, this is how we used to paint fork trucks at the last place that I worked. We didn't have a paint booth, so we would spray them with uh, buzz bombs and uh, hope that we would come out with something half decent. And it's no longer silver. It is definitely black and it is shiny. So hopefully Sissy's happy. This is fast dry, 15 minute dry paint. So we should be able to unmask this thing here in a little bit and then put it all back together, which Really, there is no putting back together because there's nothing we tore apart. All right. See you in a little bit. Hey, what's going on, YouTube? Got the old Mongo Man here. It is Thursday evening. Uh, I believe it's Cinco de Mayo. So this car is done, as you can see here in the background. Uh, it didn't turn out terrible, but it didn't turn out really good either. The paint did some funky stuff to me there as it was drying, and it kind of uh, it went satin and isn't really shiny. But, uh, hey, it's all one color now. And we can get it out of here. So we're going to do that and then get started on Too Tall. <clears throat> what I wanted to explain for Too Tall, uh, if you guys are a subscriber here, you got probably a uh, 
notification of a poll that I put together. Uh, I'm not going to be posting the weekly update uh, long form video for Too Tall. I will be, however, posting a short every day of what we're doing, a 15 second short, so you can see and keep up to date with us. But at the end of Too Tall, once uh, we wrap him up and reveal him to the world, I will post a long form, probably an hour or more long video of all the process of getting that truck ready. So from today until then, which is a 28 day countdown, you guys will get to see uh, short form videos uh, highlighting Too Tall. Now that's not to say I'm not going to post a long form video on Sunday of something else if I do have anything else to post. Again, there's a couple more videos that we have to do for the uh, El Camino. Uh, I still haven't done the wrap-up video and the, uh, and the cost video for Pat. So, you know, maybe we'll get a chance to get some of that stuff done. But I think we're going to be pretty busy with Too Tall, so there won't be much time to do that. All right, you get busy here.